seemed like you struggled to get a feel of your off-speed stuff there in that first inning. Why do you think that was? Um, I don't know. I, it did get better. Uh, rhythm got better. Um, certainly in the middle innings. Um, but Lau changeup was really good. Um, and the backdoor, you know, one out, one out backdoor curveball was uh, executed, but obviously not not the right pitch. You mentioned the, the middle innings. What did you do to, to really settle in there? And then how disappointing is it the way that sixth inning wound up unfolding? Yeah, I, I thought that I just, I just picked a little bit of the pace up through the delivery. Um, I thought that I had, you know, better better leverage on guys, and I I got a chance to start to find some of those breaking balls, um, and good changeups, like you mentioned, and the fastball command was really really good. We were able to start guys, keep them off balance, and then finish guys, and then you know, and then in the sixth, I mean. You know, the fastball was working to Meadows and, and, you know, we beat him on the pitch, but, you know, he was able to stay through it. And, uh, you know, I got, I got a Rosarena in a good spot. And I went, you know, good two seamer down and in, try to pitch for the ground ball, which was the same thing I did with Diaz in the first inning. And it, it, uh, it unraveled, it, it, you know, that, you know, I got through. So, so then that put us in a tough spot with no outs um, and probably just, Probably just ran out of ran out, ran out of ran out of good pitches at that point. You guys still take the series, but obviously had the opportunity for the sweep. Something that you guys really haven't been able to complete often this season. Why do you think you you guys have struggled in that regard? You know, sweeps are tough. It's you know, I mean, because you know the other team typically, you know, when you get when the team's up against the wall, you know, the other team typically surges and. Uh, you know, you get a little flight, fight or flight, um, and you know, it's going to be really hard when you know when your starter puts you down four to zero in the first to to, to really kind of muster something up against a you know, team of this quality. So, uh, in terms of in terms of sweeps in general, I, you know, I, I think it's hard to sweep. I think we've had some opportunities to sweep and maybe not had some stuff go our way. But in, in, in respect to this series, this one's on me. Can you go next to Ken David. Hey, Garrett, just uh, your reaction to you guys getting uh, Joey Gallo and Joey Rodriguez in a trade with Texas. Uh, another former pirate, Joey. Uh, we got, got a few of them now in this locker room that I played with in Pirate City. Um, Joey has been uh, obviously a tremendous player, superstar level talent. Um, been a tough at bat my entire career and faced him quite a bit. Um, you know, obviously the power stands out, the play discipline stands out in the the uh, you know the, the defensive pro I said he brings uh, multiple positions is I think something that people don't give him as much credit for, um, and uh, I you know part of the reason why I'm here is because you know Hal always goes for it and so does Brian and um, you know so I really really feel fortunate to be able to be in a spot where you know a club's going to make a fantastic move like that and and, and continue to push chips in um, you know it's it's um, it's, I, I feel blessed to, 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 have that, to have that opportunity to be here. Hey, Gary, you, you mentioned with Hal and, and, and Cash going for it. Were you guys always confident that they were going to go out and make some, some big move like this to really give you guys a boost? I mean, I know that the season's been kind of up and down to some degree, but you are only a few games out of the wild card and stuff. I was just curious from you guys' perspective, did you think a move like this was always going to happen? Um, I can't say for sure. Um, I, I would say just over generally, like here, part of the reason why I'm here is because, you know, big part of the reason why I'm here is, is, is because of that mentality of this organization, like I alluded to in the previous question. Um, so, you know, for me, it was like, for me personally, it's like, I, I trust, I trust that, they, that, you know, they're going to do what's best for the organization, what's best to win, you know, every time they have an opportunity to do that. 
Um, in terms of like a big splash or maybe not a big splash, I didn't necessarily put much thought into it. I just trusted that, you know, they're going to try to make us better one way or another. And, and um, they did. 